How can you enjoy the outdoors when you like literally biking through piles of garbage? With summer just around the corner, more and more people are starting to use the Okanagan Rail Trail as a way of transportation and exercise. But one local resident is concerned about the amount of garbage and pollution he's been seeing on his daily commute. I reported it to the city and um, I reported it to the city mayor, I wrote to the city administrator and literally to everybody I could reach out because I was, I was just concerned, it's just sad to see uh, because all this litter ultimately ends up in the, in the Mill Creek. It has been for over a month and there has been zero improvement. As someone who frequently uses the Okanagan Rail Trail, Andre tells Kassin that the common topic between bikers is often the garbage. I think if it continues like this, people will be just avoiding this trail. They will just stop using it. There is no pleasure in doing so. And during the heat, you can imagine there are might be there could be bad smell if this trail is littered like nobody's going to use it in response to the rail trail complaints by the community the city says it's been very busy heading into summer experiencing anywhere from 30 to 70 other service calls each and every day i think all city employees are, are quite dedicated to you know serving the community as best we can with what we got now that uh, now that the seasons have shifted well, our calls for service uh, do go up over the course of uh, you know, spring and into into summer. Obviously, with the increase in population, the increase in public activity, um, and we yeah we do what we can to manage that. Um, like I said, on a triage basis, uh, to ensure that we yeah get to the uh, to the biggest need first. With the city expecting even more service calls this summer, it should be a good reminder for residents that anyone caught illegally dumping waste can be fined anywhere between a hundred and two thousand dollars. I'm Braden Ursel in Kelowna for Castanet.